On Wednesday, with a 377 to 48 vote, the House of Representatives passed a $738 billion defense policy that not only grants federal workers 12 days of paid leave and gives military service members a 3% raise, but also authorizes the creation of a United States Space Force as the sixth branch of the military. The House passed a version of the bill in July, but since then negotiators have stripped out provisions related to President Trump's border wall and other items pushed by progressive Democrats, including blocking Trump from taking military action against Iran and banning the sale of certain munitions to Saudi Arabia. The bill still must be passed by the Senate, but President Trump has said he will sign it. The House Judiciary Committee is poised to vote Thursday to charge President Trump with abuse of power and obstruction of Congress. However, House Democrat leaders are reportedly bracing for the expected defections among a group of moderate representatives from swing districts who are supposedly concerned that a vote to impeach Trump could jeopardize their seats come November. Also on Thursday, voters in the United Kingdom voted for all 650 seats in the House of Commons, choosing between Prime Minister Boris Johnson's Conservative Party and Jeremy Corbyn's Labour Party. Johnson has campaigned heavily in the lead-up to this election, prioritizing his platform on, quote, getting Brexit done, unquote. Corbyn, meanwhile, has promised to hold a second referendum, possibly ending Brexit for good.